Happy feast day of St. Vincent Ferrer. Today we celebrate the patron of our parish. Did you know that St. Vincent Ferrer is the patron of builders? But did you also know he's the patron of reconciliation? St. Vincent lived during a time when Christianity was really torn and divided between two and eventually three popes. St. Vincent Ferrer was born on January 23rd, 1350. <clears throat> in Valencia, a large city in Spain. St. Vincent Ferrer began his studies at a young age, studying classics at the age of eight and theology and philosophy at 14. At the age of 19, despite the opposition from his parents, he entered the Dominican order and continued to serve the Lord from there. At the time of St. Vincent Ferrer's life, there was an anti-pope in place known as Benedict the 13th. St. Vincent tried many times to convince Benedict to relinquish his papal claim, and eventually he witnessed the end of Benedict XIII's reign. St. Vincent Ferrer took up the work of going through the world preaching Christ, a model we can all look up to as people of God. On this day of, on this feast day of St. Vincent Ferrer, may we, God's people, continue to preach Christ and bring the good news of Lord to us. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Dear Lord, you bless us with St. Vincent Ferrer as the patron saint of our parish. We praise you and worship you, even in hard times. In the same way, St. Vincent Ferrer worshiped and praised you during a time of trial and error in the church. We ask that as we continue to pray to our patron saint, St. Vincent Ferrer, that we are able to hear your voice clearly and follow your word. May we also preach Christ to those we encounter in our lives every single day. St. Vincent Ferrer, you are the patron saint of reconciliation, and we ask that you help us reconcile with the Lord in the bad times and good times in our lives. Grant us peace, patience, and charity. St. Vincent Ferrer, the patron saint of builders and of reconciliation, pray for us. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen.